All right, here we are. Got some concrete blocks up here. And got a window over there to put in it. Over here, I cut the tree down that was in the way. I'm getting ready to level up some blocks. I'm gonna put them all down the sides here. I actually cut that tree down, believe it or not, with this. <laughs> it took a lot of work, but it's out of there. So now I'm just going to start setting the blocks where they need to go. All right, well, here's what we've uh, got done so far. We pretty much got the level, you know, of the foundation. You can see with that two before going across that that's pretty straight. Those blocks are pretty good. That one may have to come up a little bit. Actually, what I've been doing, just stacking rocks on top, but... Uh, or now everything looks pretty good. We just got to get the stuff to start our floor with. But we got the foundation pretty much figured out here, I think.
Okay, this is gonna be our moisture barrier. Just an old tarp. I'd actually cut it up at one time trying to make a tin out of it. It didn't really, never did come together. So um, you can see there's little holes, but I even made holes where the water would gather so that the water can run out. That way we're not gonna have a swimming pool underneath the cabin. <laughs> and it'll be a moisture barrier to keep the moisture from the ground to come up. Okay, now how are we gonna do the floorboards? Well, we got the pallets here. Let me get this set up and I'll show you. Okay. You see we got the three pallets in a row at almost the length of our cabin. We'll need a little bit extra added on, but for now, we're going to take, let's see, let me get a hammer and stuff. All right. Actually, we could stand them up on their end. I think that would be easier. I'm going to get my drill and a few screws. Stand two of them up on the end. Oops. Uh, just to show you what we did here we've got three pallets that are now one big long pallet uh, we took the i guess they're two befores so they're pallet boards you can tell and we put them in between connecting each pallet together now i don't know uh if this is the proper way to do it in fact i'm pretty sure it's not but you know what uh it's our cabin so we're gonna build it it might fall down but uh at least we tr we tried uh, we're gonna try to sit this and see what it looks like Okay, well here is the start of our floor. Uh, I guess I'm using the term floor kind of loosely, but um, it seems to work. It holds my weight pretty good. Um, of course, we're not going to have the gaps, but I'm not going to just take the boards off and move them over and tighten them up. It seems like the easiest way, but I don't want to do that. What I want to do is okay here's more pallet wood and what i'm going to do start and do this line that one up nail it down probably go about right there and stagger that one and of course you know let me get a couple more sorry about the camera work but uh just show you what I'm talking about. Of course, you want to go with another one like this. Then another one here. Cut that one off, actually. But you get the idea. They're going to be staggered. 
and of course you got the pallet boards going this way four boards going that way so it should be a good strong structure and once everything is tied together and the floor goes all the way to the end then we will have a floor and we can start on the walls yeah we're gonna sit around here play with this and uh see if we can get a floor built and uh appreciate you all hanging out with us today thank you for watching and i'll see you on the next one